for the Jazz Bus Train Plane Lift Adventures YouTube channel. I hope that you are all keeping yourselves well and looking after yourselves. And today, guys, we are doing the 298, uh, which is the Starbridge Circular uh, that operates within the Pedmore uh, and um, Lye areas. And we are travelling on the Mercedes Benz Mella Strata, uh, which is a little minibus. And I hope you enjoy the journey. So we are just departing um, Stalbridge now. And we are just going to turn to the left. We're going to turn to the left. So enjoy the journey. So then, here we go. Now, uh, we're just going to go uh, via the viaduct. Uh, so we're going to go through the viaduct. So we're going to go via the viaduct. And um, so what we're going to do, we're going to follow most of the London Island route, which is the Stalbridge Street Learning Service. Now, this route is a local service to operate within Stalbridge. It's the second circular to operate in Stalbridge. Uh, besides the 10A, 10C, and the 250 and the 251. We're now going under the viaduct. The number 9 link carries on straight to go via the line. But we'll join up at Lye later on. We're now going to go across the Hungry Hill. Now we are joined up with the 28, which is the which is run by National Express West Midlands, just like the number nine. But however, the 28 used to be operated by Diamond Buses and was not at the 287 from when it was known as Hanson's. And also Hanson's also did this route, and of course the 219 is joined on with this route. The 10A and 10C are also joined to each other. We are crossing over the Snow Hill Lines, which is served by West Midlands Railway, formerly known as London Midland and Central Trains, and occasional children's services to London Marlborough. We're now coming across the new farm. So we're going to turn to the left. So we are going to turn to the left. So uh, here we go.
So we have now swapped into the opposite window. So we're now in the opposite window now. So we're now going to join up uh, with the number nine shortly. But we're only going to follow it as for only a short distance, and then we'll then proceed um, towards the winal area. to the centre of the Just by Lyme Library, the public library for Lyme. Now, these Mercedes Benz and other structures uh, are built for like the smaller roads. Uh, I know they have, they have a batch at Redditch Depot and also at Tiverdale Depot. Well, Tiverdale have a lot of matters for use on their tender groups on the 13s, 223s, but they don't seem to now put them on the 223 because due to the fact they were only in place uh, when they did the duplicate service due to the COVID but now with the COVID now relaxed as well it's just like a different version now so we are now joined up with the number 7 service now These malastrutters do bounce uh, quite a lot. So the number seven goes up that hill, and uh, we're going to actually turn to the left. So we're going to turn to the left. Transport, WMSMT, then it was taken over, then it got branded as I go, 
and then Hudson's talk service in 2016-2017 and then it was then taken back to Diamond because Diamond bought them out and Diamond has kept the service running uh, and in the past they used any start SOFs and um, and also maybe on Vara 200s and also uh, an Optair Sama and now it's run by a Malastrata. So as you can tell we're just at temporary traffic lights at present um, so we're just about to move. So we're just gonna like it might change back to red in a minute and might stop the video and then restart as soon as possible. So anyway, here we go. So we're now going up the hill. So we're going up the brook Holloway. So we're going to be joining up onto the number seven route. So the number seven is going to be joining us in a minute. Uh, and of course the 142 service, which is the established to Hale Zoe. Now the 142 um, used to be run with central buses and the Riva, the DNG Midland Diamond and of course National Express from when it was numbered the 247 and the 248. Um, the only 247 left is the Evesham one which is run by, um, which is run by Diamond. And that was going to face us an uncertain withdrawal, but that service had been saved due to the fact it's the only route that goes to Evesham because there's no train link between Redditch and Evesham. Well, there was many, many years ago, but that's been withdrawn. And of course, there's no direct train between Kidderminster, Bromsgrove, and Redditch. So, there's no alternative. So, certain services have been saved 52, 52R. Because due to the fact being more frequent, the 182, 183 isn't, it's only like once each time, every two hours, on certain trips. So we're now going across the line. bit of a bump earlier.
So then guys, as you can tell, we are just completing the 298, which is the salvage circular. Uh, so this route has seen variety of operators over the years, such as Travel West Midlands. Well, so there's been DNG Midland, which used to be known as Choice Travel. And uh, DNG Midland was then branded as Arriva Midlands North. And they were based at Wentzfield. So they just put the Arriva cover uh, vinyls over the uh, Midland logo and then they were painted into the D Arriva livery so there's been darts on this one when Arriva did it and Octair Solos and Diamond took over the contract of the service in 2017 from when they bought Hansons out but however uh, due to the recent uh, change with all these services, a handful of these services are being cut back. And this is one of them that is facing the axe almost. And the 299, which I'll sh cover after this one. And of course, recently we saw the 10A and 10C. And however, I believe the 250 and 251 are staying. I can't say if they're going to get withdrawn. And of course, other operators have also made appearance on this route, like WMSNT, West Midlands Special Needs Transport, which was branded as IGO Buses. Uh, well, was then become part of IGO. And uh, Hanson's Buses used to do this service because they used to use uh, Dennis Darts a lot in ADL Enviro 200s uh, just before they were passed on to uh, Diamond. And um, Diamond, they put on variety of vehicles on, especially a Volvo B7 RLE, right Eclipse Urban Body. So there's been some great uh, buses that's done the service over the years. And um, so it, there has been a major change in terms of routes, etc. Uh, so I will be continuing to maintain the channel of all times. Of course I am, so more videos are going to be uploaded. And uh, feel free to subscribe as well here on Joe's Bus Train Plane Lift Adventures, the best YouTube channel that you can name of all time. And of course, we're almost 100 subscribers away to beat 1K, which would be a 1,000 subscribers. And that will turn the tide of Joe's Bus Train Plane Lift Adventures for, for an entire life. And of course, I am very excited. And I can't wait. Of course I can't wait. So... It's going to be exciting. More videos are going to come up on the channel. So the Joe's Plus Train Plane Lift Adventures is not going far. It will be maintained. More videos will be on the channel very, very soon. So I will keep you up to date, as always, with more exciting videos that will come on a day-to-day -day basis. So we're almost at one at 1,000 subscribers. So that's going to be brilliant. Uh, once we reach a thousand subscribers, it will change our lives for good. Of course, Travel West Midlands used to run this also under West Midlands Travel when they used to use the Leyland National buses. And that was run from the, I think it was the Pensnet or the former Hearts Hill Depot. Uh, so we're just coming into Old Swinford now. Uh, so we are penciling in more videos in the next upcoming weeks. Um... So tomorrow, all being well, we should be doing the Stafford run, uh, which is the 878 from Wolverhampton. Or we might do an alternative route. Um, we just don't know for sure yet. Um, and then on the 27th, which is this Thursday, we are going to do some of the kiddie routes. I think I might pick either the 15 or the 9s. And then Friday, I don't know what we're going to do yet. Uh, Saturday, there'll be no videos. Sunday, no videos. Monday, no videos. Next Tuesday, I'm not sure what video we might add. Might only be small videos. Then Wednesday, no video. Thursday, next week, um, we're going to do the 74A from Dudley to West Bromwich. Uh, Friday next week, I think we'll do some of the Let's Goes and do the 27 to Wolverhampton. Uh, on the 5th, so there will be no videos on weekends. Monday, there's going to be... Uh, Monday next week, there won't be any videos. Uh, uh, well, and then Tuesday, I think we're going to go on the 318 to Bromsgrove. And then 
and then we'll be back in the Kidderminster area on the 10th. On the 14th, uh, I think that we might do... Uh, we might go out and might wait for another week. Might wait till the 21st of... So, I think the 21st of, this, of November, I think we might do Canuck stuff. And then, on the 24th, we'll... And then on the 15th... Then on the 22nd of November... Um, we don't know what videos we'll do. Uh, we might um, might do a few routes. Might go on the DRT Bromsgrove. Uh, might do the DRT Bromsgrove then on and then Wednesday. Um, and then Wednesday. Don't know. Thursday uh, might be Kidderminster. I'm not 100 percent sure yet. And then Friday we don't know. Then Monday after, don't know, we might put Stafford or Canuck in for the 28th. Uh, and then and then all being well, we should be in a good place. Uh, coming up to Christmas, as Christmas is like two months away in eight weeks. So it's going to be exciting. Christmas is going to be one of the best times of the year. So I will be making sure that I get to a 1,000. And of course, I'll be getting to a 1,000. I'll be reaching a 1,000. Up until Christmas this year. Well, I was aiming to do it for this year. Uh, well for the previous year. But apparently we weren't going that high enough. Uh, but however. Now all being well. We should be getting to 1k subscribers. So we should be getting to 1k. Which will be a thousand subscribers. And we'll be reaching. The target and the tipping point. Here on Joe's Bus Train Plane Lift Adventures. So we're just arriving into Stalbridge, so we're going to be moving next to the 299, which this service interworks with. So this service interworks with the 299. So we'll be doing the 299 next, uh, which is the Stalbridge Circular. So we'll be doing the 299, uh, which is worked by the same vehicle, a Melostrata. And, um, and then... That will complete our videos for the week. So we, and I'm so happy that this channel is still keeping afloat, and we will maintain this channel of all time. Of course we will. So welcome back to Starbridge Interchange. We're not finished completely yet because we still got the 299 to complete, and then that will be the end of the video on the 299. And that will complete the Starbridge Circular Services. So, I hope you enjoyed it. Look after yourselves, guys. Take care. And I'll see you on the next video, video which will be the 299. So, I'll see you next on the 299. So, welcome back to Starbridge Interchange. Hope you enjoyed the journey. See you on the next video, which will be the 299. Uh, which will be in the same bus, same viewpoint, and I will be updating the channel on a regular basis. So here we are, back at Starbridge Interchange. So we are moving stands due to the fact that a National Express West Midlands was sitting on the 298 and 299 stand. So we've moved to the 8 and the 251 stand, and also the 10A and 10C.